Okay, enough playing with that one. I just liked it so much. So pretty. You're giving me a hard time, honey. It was. You took care of it, though, didn't you? I did. You want me warm your coffee for you? Please. Okay. Here's the uh, lobster claw clasp, and this is a herringbone chain. Very beautiful. Silky, no kinks, no discoloration, but not silver or gold. It's got a little bit of magnet magnetism to it. It's magnetic. See? But it's absolutely beautiful. You would not know the difference. Very pretty. Next one, lobster claw class. It's an it's a loft. I'm gonna go ahead and put it on skinny here. Oh, excuse me, honey. It's got these little tassel or fringe here to the side on both sides. And it comes down to these stations that have rhinestones on both sides. I like that so no matter which way it turns, it's on the right side. Another station of rhinestones on both sides. Right here. And then there, that's a nice layering piece also. Very pretty. The next is another chain. It is a spring ring clasp. It's a rope chain. And I believe it's multi-metaled. And I want to make sure. No, this is cord. It's not actual chain, it's crocheted cord. That gives it that bronze, silver, and gold look. You can see it right here better. Very unusual. This is very smooth. There's no wear on it. You, there's your spring ring clasp. It's in great shape. Be nice with the pendant too. Nice piece. It's fairly long too. Let's measure it real quick. Yes, let's. For the fun of it. I'd say it's about 12 inches, 24 inches. Mm, you're probably right. Close enough. It's a little over, but not much. Ding, 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 winner, winner. These remind me of those candy necklaces you used to eat. But they were done in more pastel colors. Remember those? Uh, mm -hmm. I don't know if you remember them, but I do. Because I'm so old. What are you saying? And I'm always saying I forget? Yeah. But, okay. <laughs> no. I just didn't eat those This is not hooked right. In fact, the hook... It's just bent on it. It needs a little round thingy. Beads are nice. This is what they've done with the hook. And you can put it over your head, but I would fix that. I just, it's just unattractive. I don't know why they did why they did that. They just didn't want to fix it. Okay, I'm going to put these because they're nice wooden beads. I'll put those in the hobby lot. As much as I don't want to. I want to fix it all. That's what's wrong with me. I just can't seem to throw anything away. And I wasn't born during the Depression. Good thing. And I haven't been without. Yeah, it is a good thing. I'd probably yeah, be I'm worse. Good thing I'm still here and you didn't throw me out. So. No, I'd never throw you out. Yeah. Little pearl necklace. It's got a spring ring clasp. Thank you very much. Welcome, darling. Here is a, I don't know, it hooks on that. It's a pocket chain. Or something you chain this and you hook something on that. Yeah, you hook be. this on your belt and or your pocket and then you attach something to that end. That's what that is. 
Here's a Webkins. Y'all remember the Webkins? I mean, they're still around. I love Webkins. And the grandkids love them, too. No, I'm thinking about... Yeah, that's Webkins. Yeah. 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 And the games, on the video games, I love those, too. It's got a little makeup or something on the back. I'm going to clean that off. It's marked on the back. I still couldn't get it off. I'm not sure what that is on the back, but it's got an M with a circle around the M. I couldn't even get it to get off of my nail. There's nothing wrong with it, though. That's cute, Webkins. I think this is a thingy for your hair. Little beads. So the beads are cute. I'm going to put this in the Hobby Lot. Cute little beads on that. Oh, that's cute. Hello, kitty. Yes. Cute. And then the little pink beads. Hello, kitty. We'll go to the other. And the little floral beads. This is beautiful. It's got a heart class um, toggle. Close in their beads. Very beautiful floral. Let's see if we get close up. Come on. They're very pretty. Let's see if this is magnetic. I know where it is. No, it's not. We're going to test it, because it looks pretty silver there. always looks silver for y'all, but I can see when it's got that copper or that brassy underneath. Yeah, it's silver. Awesome. Another piece of silver close in A. <laughs> I love it when this sounds make sense. With what we're doing. <laughs> yeah, it's great. Because we have no, no choice yet, yeah, control over what he says, folks. Hey, so. that's not magnetic. Hmm. We have to test it. Yes, we do. No. You see copper? Yeah. Okay, it's copper based. That's what he said. Oh, yeah. Ooh, he's becoming an expert, but it's very nice. I have one of these that has, um, well, I got two of them that had, um, Labradorites in them. They're very pretty. Calling me an expert. It has been drip under pressure. <laughs> I don't get it. X is has been. Uh -huh. The spurt is a drip of, of water under pressure. Oh. It spurts out. So. Oh, okay. <laughs> All right. He's educating me again. He's an expert. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> drip under pressure. Has been drip under pressure. Has been drip under pressure. Yeah, you're not under pressure now. And you're not a drip. <sighs> That's pretty. Very pretty. They're glass. The crystals. Is there a little bit of pink in there? Blush? Mm-hmm. Oh, okay. This has got a crystal that is uh uh no. Okay. A crystal that is uh crackled, glass like, with a beautiful cap, rollo chain, antique. It's an older chain. It's got a spring ring clasp. There's no marks on it. I like that. I like that single drop there. It's very cool. Okay, couldn't stand it. I have to show this one next. He tells me. He dictates what I show, too. He's just the boss. He thinks he is, anyway. Yeah, that's... <laughs> 
we'll let him think it. That's beautiful. Statement necklace. It does have some wear on the chain here. But all the stones are here. And that's hard to find. So. That's pretty little skinny. And you can see what it would look like. Against black dress. Under normal lighting. It's very pretty. There you go, Angel. Mm -hmm. Thank you. And the next one is a wiggly, wiggly, snaky. No, I'm just teasing. This is what it reminded me of when it was wiggling around. It's got a lot of claw clasp. It's all sea beads. It needs a pendant, a heavy pendant on it, because other than that, it lays like that. So, did we have any pendants in there? Not yet. Okay, well, I'll set this aside. What, what, what color? I don't know. What any color. That. Well, it wouldn't work with this. Why not? Maybe because it couldn't go through there. Needs to be heavier okay. than that. That's what I said. You're right. We we'll just leave it to the side a moment. Next thing we have is a toggle clasp. Whoops. It's like a horse bit here. You have textured and polished chain. This needs to be cleaned. Very pretty silver tone. There we go one more time. There you go, honey. Thank you. This is broken. It is acrylic beads. We're going to put it in the hobby lot. It's all black beads. They're fasted. It's going in the hobby lot. <clears throat> Next is one of these tied necklaces. It's got these, this pretty bead here. I love those. It's got these clear beads. I believe they're acrylic. I'm going to put this in the craft, the hobby lot. Whew. Caught it before he said something. <laughs> I heard Yay, it though. Amy, I know you did. <laughs> I know. Lobster claw class extender with the bead. That's the extender's got a knot in it I have to get out because somebody didn't do their job. Here's multi stranded teal. It helps hard to find these days. It sure is. <laughs> Isn't that beautiful? Love that color. Isn't that pretty? It's even got these chips here that are. They're cool, so they're some kind of stone. I'm just not sure if they're dyed or if that's natural. Very pretty. Ooh, I love this. Love the color. I love blue. Goodbye. Come back another blue. Lobster Claw Class, extender with the bead, and this is Express. Yes, Express. Nice silver tone chain. And these look like faux turquoise and maybe real. I don't know. They're cold. That's all I do know. They're very pretty. They look real. They look like real turquoise. If those are faux turquoise, they're well-made faux turquoise. And if somebody has an opinion on there and thinks I'm way out of line, just please make a comment. All comments are welcomed. Unless they're immoral. 
unlawful or unethical. Other than that, they're acceptable. Here's a pretty black and pearl. These feel really strange. I don't know what they are. They feel they're they're very uh, warm, so they're not stone. I'm just not sure what they are. Feels very smooth. It's a pretty necklace. Here's, here's a shell necklace that buttons up. Here's a beaded bib necklace. Beautiful colors. Beautiful beadwork. Here's the back. It's in excellent condition. Well made. It's a felted back. On a cord with the lobster claw clasp. With an extender. Very pretty. Somebody did pretty work on that. The next is, he's digging in the bag, uh -huh. making noise. This says 925. It's got a spring ring clasp. It says 925. Here's your um, necklace with the various sizes of rings. We've got a knot right here. Oh my gosh. Yes, he didn't want to ruin my self-esteem by getting the knot out for me. <laughs> Here's the circles. That was his excuse, and he's sticking to it. Pretty much. They're not magnetic. This necklace is more than likely really silver. I'm going to test it. Yes, we are. We're going to test it. That. Here's the... We're going to test the little clasp. We're going to test the little tag. Make sure everybody's telling the truth. And here we go. This is the rings on the necklace. This is the spring ring clasp. And this is the little tag. So here we go. Do the tag first, because it's the smallest. And I can't tell anything. I might not have rubbed it hard enough. Here is the spring ring. I don't see anything. Okay, here's the rings. And I definitely see. Yep, that's a uh, 125. Okay. Let me test the other pieces and parts real quick. Again. Again. I know sometimes you just don't rub hard enough. But they're hard to hold. Oh, mercy. This actually hurts after a while doing this stuff. You want me to do it for me? Nope. Oh, okay. My skin, skin is thin and scrawny. Okay, the clasp. Okay, let's see if that did it. This 
is the tag. And yes, there is red there. And this is the clasp. And yes, there is red there. Come on. You can see it as it dries. You can see the dark red coming through. Awesome. So yes, this is sterling. Wow, another sterling piece. That's what, the third or fourth one? Oh, a little bit more than that, yeah. Awesome. Get me some more ugly boxes. Mm -hmm. Nobody else wants. A little unicorn, enameled. Here's the back. Found a gold tone chain. It's very good condition. It's got a lobster claw clasp and extended with the bead. Very cute. Here's a little planter bracelet. Very cute and different colors of pink. Here's another clamper. This is acrylic in there and then you have this stamped, beautiful stamped silver in the middle here. I don't see any marks. There's not hardly any wear, if any at all. There's no wear in it. Very nice. We have a clamper watch. Studio. Hammered metal. You have a metallic uh, face on that. Very pretty silver. Got the studio name on the other side. Just curious. Just want to see what it looks like on. Fits really well. I think it would fit a smaller arm good too. Let's see it clamps nice and tight. So if your arms are real small and you have trouble finding watches to fit, that would fit. But it does have some weight to it. Keep that in mind. Here's a pretty little pearl stretchy. Here's a American Eagle. I guess it's got a plus sign there. I believe that's American Eagle, but I'm not sure. This has got a toggle clasp, nice chain, nice piece. Is it magnetic? Nope. But it doesn't look silver. Does it look silver to you? Nope. Yeah, I didn't to me either. Let's see what it is. Maybe it has a copper base or brass. Yes, yep. copper base. Very nice. Mm, this is nice too. It's got some beautiful cat's eye and silver filigree beads. I'm looking for a class. And I'm not seeing one. Nope. So we're going to start it here. Here we go. See the beautiful filigree silver tone beads? Nice textured chain. Rolo chain, those beautiful cat's eye, and then the smoky, um, not smoky, but the uh, mm, brushed glass beads, silver again, it's very pretty, I want to test it, Let's see if it's magnetic, and it is, it's gorgeous. Nice levering piece. Nice and long. Here you go. Hi. I wasn't talking to you. Oh. Sorry. Here is a heart bracelet. I don't know if this is uh, turquoise. Almost looks like spiderweb turquoise, doesn't it? Here's the 
Here's your clasp. I don't see any markings on it. That's very pretty. Oh, it's in the velvet box. Oh. Louis, Louis L. Roth. It's a tie thing. With even a button. Huh. And is that a tie thing, honey? Uh, I don't know. I don't think so. I wonder what it is. Got a beautiful Figaro chain on it. Bracelet? An anklet? I don't no, know. No, I don't think so. It's got a button on it. Well, I don't need nothing. Just well, could have just had it there for, to show maybe you. Maybe it hangs on the. Oh, that's what it is. Maybe yeah. it hangs on the button. Yeah. Maybe. That would make sense. And then you have a little necklace. Except I can't get it. There we go. That's probably what it does. Yeah. Well, that's cool. Very cool. I don't see any marks on this. And it's magnetic. Very pretty, though. You're going to hate me, but there's this little <clears throat> knot right here. Oh, there. I hate him. If there's a knot. I don't hate him. And he tells me that's okay. Cause I'll get it out before I show it. <laughs> Here's a watch. It is. Can anybody tell? I can't. New York and Company. Clamper. There. Let me get the knot out. Okay, this is the one I got the tangle out of. It was right up here at the, the bead. The beaded extender. And it's a little cat's eye bead. This is well made. Off the claw class. It's wired, but it's beautiful. Look at all these cat's eye beads and rhinestones. Very pretty. Love the colors. Very pretty. Okay. This probably needs a big bag. Yeah. You don't want to crush the water. No. That's pretty good with the beads. Yeah, it is. Very pretty. Well made. Nice wire in it. The next one is a lobster claw class. It's gunmetal. No extender. And this is beautiful. Little rose pendant. As soon as I get it turned around the right way, I'm going to put it on fancy. I mean, skinny. Put it on somebody. There you go. Very cute. I don't know if the roses here are supposed to be like that. Looks like they're missing the center. But it's done here, here, and there, so... <clears throat> I don't know. If it should be like that or not. We're going to assume it is. Wow, look at this brooch. Beautiful Christmas brooch. The enameling is just gorgeous. It's got all its little crystals. Here's the back. It's not marked. It's a nice size and it's beautiful. <clears throat> Headband. Ooh, this is pretty. It's 
this goes with that other necklace. Here's the bracelet that goes with that necklace with the crackled glass hmm. pendant. Remember that, which one I'm talking about? Uh, yeah, unfortunately. Okay. Well, yeah, I'll find it. Okay. Somehow. Let's find it. Oh. Lobster claw class. This is a loft. Very pretty necklace. These are acrylic. As you get on down there, they're glass. These are glass ones. These are glass. These up here are not. Well, I don't know. Maybe they are. No, they're not. They only get cold when you get down to here. The bigger ones. These are glass here. Very pretty. And then there's your drape. And on that drape you have rhinestones in there. Or not rhinestones, but beads. Shiny little beads. It's a very pretty piece. You want me to do it? Sure, if you want to. Okay, we have designer Star Trek earrings. Da 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 da. Da 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 da. That's not Star Trek music. Oh. <laughs> I know, but isn't it beautiful? They're post on a card. And we have some Roblin. Roblin earrings. Aren't those cute? Those are cute. They were $19.95. They're post. See, I was paying attention that time. I like those. I want to put them in the same bag. They're different. Okay, honey. I'm going to one out of the bag. I'm going to sit on the... I'll put them Cram against each other and knock each other up. You uh, know. <laughs> See what? Knock each other out and scratch <laughs> up and... <laughs> oh, gosh. You can't take me anywhere. I'm turning into you. <laughs> Scary. Little gold tone earrings. Here's the back. They are also clip and they need cleaning. Polishing. Guys be crazy. I need uh, somebody to come wash my jewelry for me. They have a job for eons. Yeah, it'd be a lifetime job. Do clean them up before we send them out, though. Here we go. 